250 coins each. Mario features Mario, Toad, Luigi, and Yoshi, and also Princess Peach, whereas Toad features mostly Toad, Peach, Mario, and looks like Yoshi, whereas Mario only appears on one folder. You can also get the Bowser folder, which consists of Bowser, Bullet Bills, and Bowser Jr. on folders and bookmarks. Those all cost 250 coins each. There's a tote bag, which is 250 coins each and features a mushroom on it with some dots. Uh, there's four kinds of fans. Uh, perfect for when you're in hot places. I know Japan usually gets quite hot. I'm not sure if it's as hot as in uh, downtown Florida, but perfect for those hot, hot days, you know, when the sun's beating down on you. There's the blooper fan featuring the bloopers, the pink Animal Crossing fan, the fireworks fan from also Animal Crossing. It's kind of nice, has different colors. And the Mario fan features classic icons and different characters. Those fans all cost 300 coins each. Super Mario shoelaces, they come in yellow and white. But I believe you can get both of them for 300 coins each. The white ones feature power-ups, and the yellow ones feature enemies from the Mario series. The History of Handheld Systems features Game Boy, uh, Mr. Game & Watch, 3DS, DSi, and DSi XL, Game Boy Advance, all those, and that's at 300 coins. You can get Giant Me AR cards. The AR card is for those of us who have 3DS's and that that'll cost you 300 coins and it makes your Mario it has it is double sided with Mario on one side and the uh, question mark block on the other and that costs you 300 coins but it makes Mario and your me super huge uh, there are some greeting cards Mario and Luigi greeting cards and Nintendogs greeting cards. Both of those are at 300. The Wii remote holders come in black and white. Uh, costs you 300 coins each. The Kirby patch set. Uh, for those of us who have holes or stuff in our clothing. Or just want to have like a Kirby on our clothes. Uh, it's from the Wii game Kirby. Uh, Kirby's Epic Yarn. And you have two styles. You can get the saucer and the off-roader, or Kirby and Prince Fluff, the main characters from the game. You can get terry cloth towels for washing your face and you know just getting ready in the morning the yellow one features question marks goombas fire flowers the red one features mario and the blue one seems to feature mostly enemies from the series of mario uh the legend of Zelda 25th anniversary poster set unfortunately the poster uh excuse me unfortunately the posters of the screenshots of the posters have not uh, fully appeared on this website on the Club Nintendo website that is so I cannot show them to you but I have them personally and let me tell you they are amazing and it features mostly Link and two posters are of Skyward Sword, which is the recently released game for the Wii. 
that cost four hundred dollars. Uh, not dollars. Coins. Sorry. There is the Donkey Kong poster set featuring Donkey Kong mostly and how he's evolved over the years and him and Diddy Kong. That also costs four hundred coins. Mara poster set. Uh. has how Mario evolved, Mario in his different forms, and a Super Mario featuring uh, most of the characters from the series. Legend of Zelda poster set uh, features how Link has evolved over the years. This one features Link on as he appears in Phantom Hourglass. And this one is of Twilight Princess. All the posters cost 400 coins. The pen cases come in r r <coughs> red and blue, and they cost 400 coins each. You can get Wii Remote Wrist Strap. And those come in four colors, but you get all of them for 450 coins. They come in yellow, red, blue, and green. Blue one is kind of navyish. Uh, Animal Crossing cards, so like playing cards, those cost for 500 coins. You can also get the classic Super Mario t-shirt, and you can specify your size of t-shirt that you would like to get and it features Princess Peach, Luigi, Cheep Cheep, Bowser, Mario, Toad, Goomba, Blooper, and Koopa from the original Super Mario Brothers game for the NES and that's at 550 coins. At another 550 coins you can get the messenger bag has it the star on it and this one's also big, bigger than the other carrying bag. You can also get the stylus and game card, uh, mostly for DS games. And that costs you 600 coins. The stylus and game card case, which is kind of just a blue case, uh, costs you 600 coins. And it doesn't have much of a design except for blue. Uh, Hanafudu cards, which are Japanese type of playing cards, they cost you 800 coins. Uh, there is, and it features Mario characters. There is the Game & Watch collection. Uh, costs you 800 coins, and it is a Nintendo DS game. 800, another 800 coins, and you can get the Game & Watch collection too featuring another series of Game & Watch classic games. For 1200 coins you can get Game & Watch Ball which actually looks exactly like how they used to make well maybe not exactly but looks sort of like a replica of what how they used to make Game & Watches back in the old days. And currently unavailable is the Nintendo 3DS game card case and you can also switch up the outside and how it looks. You can put Luigi, Mario, and different styles on the front. I hope you decide to check out Club Nintendo. You can find it at www.clubnintendo.com. We will also be covering Paper Mario with 3DS, which is coming up shortly, I believe. Although, we will take a look at Wikipedia for the first batch of news about it. And here we are. This, as I was saying, was Paper 
is Paper Mario, the 2012 video.